Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. I hope that you're all doing very well. And today is a guillotine altered form ray guide because I haven't done a ray guide in like months. <laughs> we interrupt this broadcast to bring you an emergency update. We have exclusive footage direct from Niantic HQ and their latest meeting on how to f up Pokemon Go. I did try to sneak in in person, but I was spotted rather quickly. Oh, well, excuse me, do you work here? Yes, yes I work here. Hmm, you sound a bit too intelligent for me. Okay, what number comes after seven? Eight? Wrong, I knew it. It is money, okay? Money comes after seven, money is everything. Security! Can we get security here? It's okay, I'll, I'll, I'll go and I'll have the camera, thank you. Okay, buffoons and cretins of Niantic, we are once again here for an extremely important meeting. But before we begin, I must conduct a quick test just to make sure everybody is suitable here we go again. to be here. Now, what colour is this? It's yellow. Yellow. Please get out. Get out. Yes, you. Circle. Circle. At least one person knows what to say. Very good. Right. One person being right is good enough for me. Yes. Let's begin. As you may or may not be aware of, there is currently a global pandemic going on. We've already combated one of the main problems with the game by bringing in remote raiding, uh, with the remote raid pass bringing us in a lot of money, which I'm extremely happy with. So, oh, by the way, is somebody working on the friends invite system for that remote raiding? Nope. Good, good. Now, because we were meant to be working on a friend invite thing. Friend invites was actually included in the, uh, the notes. Getting their free coins from gyms, which is beautiful news, because that means we're making stacks. But unfortunately, as is the way with players, you know, they're, they're moaning on social media, they're fighting back, they want free coins. Ugh. So we have to find a new way to get free coins uh, in the game. Uh, any suggestions? Maybe we could add coin bonuses for you know daily spin and catch, and maybe even stamp. Um, I think that. Would I mean, be ever the since our last from... meeting, I don't understand a word that you're saying. Um, so we'll move it swiftly on to somebody else. Uh, what about you? Whoa! Leave the coin system as it is. I mean, that's a potential. What about giving five coins to a player for? completing a task, like making an excellent throw. Like it, um, but obviously with doing that, we no way can we leave the gym coin per hour system as it is normally. Why not have the gym system and the task system run alongside each other? So you still get 50 coins a day. Say you get five coins from doing the task, um, and then you get 45 from being in a gym. It evens out. Again, I'm struggling to understand what you're saying. Um, I think it might be because you're using too much logic. Yes, I so have too much kindly sense. Kindly shut your pie hole and wait for me to tell you what to post to the Twitter account, okay? I have an idea. If we want to stop people going to using gyms as much, we've got to adjust the coins per hour system. Um, it's currently at six per hour. Maybe if we bring it down to two per hour, um, that would that would equalise it, I think. Uh, we've got to deter people from going outside. It's a very serious situation. Where is the maths? Yes, the maths guy. How many hours would it now need for a player to earn 50 coins in the game with only two coins per okay, hour? Okay, boss, just give me a second, okay? 25 hours to get your coins. No joke. 25 hours to earn 50 coins. Even the f***ing dog knows that. It's no use. I, I can't count that Excellent high. work. So, let's put this into action straight away. Um, and, I mean, I'm feeling so generous. I think because of what we're doing with the gym system, we need to up the daily coins from 50 to 55. Feeling, feeling dizzy. I'm so just the most generous thing we've ever done in the game. I'm not sure I can cope. Let me read out this temporary article to you. Uh, trainers, soon you'll be able to earn five coins from doing the following tasks. Make an excellent throw, evolve a Pokemon, make a great throw, use a berry to help catch a Pokemon, take a snapshot with your buddy, 
catch a Pokemon, power up a Pokemon, make a nice throw, transfer a Pokemon, and win a raid. Excellent choice of tasks, uh, very menial and um, trivial. I'm not sure about win a raid, to be honest. It uh, also sounds better than it actually is. What? What do you mean? Well, obviously, we mean that they'll get five coins from those tasks. You do mean that players get five coins per task. <laughs> Even you fell for it. Oh my god. You are f***ing joking. This is perfect. Twitter storm incoming and I don't have to deal with it. Five coins for doing ten tasks. You're mad. Niantic, you're mad. In turn, you did say five coins for doing those tasks, didn't you? Just wait, yes. See? The best mind in this room knows exactly what he said. What did I do? You had to open your mouth. Ah, uh, money. For crying out loud, if it's gonna be that bad, why are we changing the gym system? It has to be balanced out. How is it balanced? How does that balance it out? It takes 25 hours to get 50 coins from the gyms and 22 and a half to get the remaining 45 if you do the five tasks. That's just stupid. You doing the maths calculations is actually extremely offensive to the guy we've got employed to do that job. How dare you use the calculator in my presence. We actually have got a baboon hired to do that, so I don't know why you're deviating from your job. This is literally as stupid as removing the remote raiding system we implemented and took weeks to develop and now taking it away when it's most needed. Oh, well, maybe we should take out remote raiding. No, no, it was a, it, it was a joke. It was a f***ing metaphor, okay? We can't do this. It's ridiculous. Don't worry, we'll have a system rollout just like any other big feature. Um, so, uh, f*** it. Like, the Australians always get trolled with events and stuff. Oh so, uh, the Australian manager, are you okay with um, us basically using your country as a guinea pig? Are you f***ing serious? Oh my god, no. Oh, Jesus Christ. Gotta keep me updated with this Australian dude. This if guy everybody is really objects to this system, this new system that we will put in and then potentially just leave in because f*** the players, um, we could always remove free coins from the game entirely. What have I done? What does everybody think about that? Stick to making coffee. We just pretend it's a glitch. Come on, how many bugs are still in the game? How long did it take us to fix that raid dodge glitch? Literally two years. And people forgot about it. They stopped complaining about it because they knew that we wouldn't do it. So if we take out the free coins, after about two months, the number of complaints will just drop. Just drop down like that because nobody in the player base can keep arguing with us for over two months because we don't listen to you. All right, let me know how this curry goes. I'll be in my swimming pool. Yeah, I, I, won't, come, I won't come to the next meeting. Niantic, you are idiots.